Yeah. 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 So this is the Federal High Court of Abuja where Nnam Dekano, the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB, is going to be arraigned. He's expected to be arraigned here at the Federal High Court of Abuja any moment from now. Kano has just been extradited back to Nigeria after he's been absent for more than 14 months from the court. He was being prosecuted at the court for alleged threatenable felony following his agitation for the Republic of Biafra. Kano was arrested in the UK and brought back to Nigeria and he is expected at the Federal High Court Abuja here where the cable is covering, covering life any moment from now at the Federal High Court Abuja where Namdekan is going to be arranged any moment from now by the Federal Government. They don't go. See their motor now. See the motor where they are. From what you understand here, the federal government has just brought Kano to court but they are preventing the media from getting you know um pictures of him he's been just he just arrived at the court two moments ago but uh you know covered by uh, the gs operators that just brought him to court uh, over there so we are here at the federal health court of the namde kano is expected to be arraigned any moment from now. The cable is live at the court premises because here is a one of whom the camera lawyer, a member of his legal team, standing here with us. Expected to be arraigned here any moment from now. Of course, I was here when they brought you. So from what we are learning now, Kano was uh, secretly taken, brought inside the court premises and the federal government uh, prosecution team had applied for remand from what we understand and they couldn't allow the media to get a glimpse of him. But at the moment, it seems um, they are still holding him detained in one of the court rooms at the moment. Uh, we are here with the team and see if he speaks to the cable on the situation. I, I don't even know whether it's not that I called you. Yes. You know, what are we talking about? Do you know what I'm talking about? I don't know how confused you are about the government. Yeah, just tell us what, how would you assess, how confused are you? What would you say you've learned? Have you been informed about any development so far? Has the federal government informed you about any development? Have you been officially communicated that your client was uh, arrested and is arrested by the department? So we are here with uh, one of our uh, a member of Nam the Kano's uh, legal team, his name is Maxwell. Uh, so he was going to address the media, but he just declined that he isn't going to speak again. Over here of uh, you know, intimidation by the DSO of 80s that just brought Nam the Kano moments ago.
live here at the Federal High Court, Abuja. Here, Kano was supposed to be arranged. We are still waiting for his arrangement, as you can see. The media is here present. The cable covers, you know, the cable is present at the moment. Uh, trying to see how things unfold. There is apprehension, you know, there is tension even within the court premises. No one knows for sure where Kano has been taken to, any of the court rooms he's been taken to. He was expected to be arranged at the court room 5 at the Federal High Court complex here, but uh, it appears as though the federal government has maybe changed their plans or you know, keeping hold on that. So we expect that the federal government is going to apply for a man to get him detained in the DSS custody pending his next appearance in court. None of that is certain yet. The federal government's position team is silent on that yet. The cable has earlier approached him and became his uh, lawyer, one of his lawyers. But he says he can't speak at the moment. That's him standing over there, Mr. Obara. So yeah, we are live here at the Federal Health Court Abuja, where Kano is supposed to be arranged. It's a full house with the media here, with lawyers on the ground, and uh, with police officers and other security agencies, tight security here at the high, Federal High Court premises, where Kano is expected to be arranged. And we are still waiting here. This is the Federal High Court Abuja, where Kano is being prosecuted for alleged personal felony. He was granted the in 2017 and was he left the court. Uh, he, he was granted in 2017, yeah, and he was released from prison where he was being held, yeah, in 2019. And since then, no word yet about his appearance. I confirm whether he is the one or not. So there is a confusion at the court premises now. The position team, the guest operatives that brought him to court, say that they, they didn't want the media to get close to Kano or to even see a group of him. He was covered, Kano was covered, he dared to cover with the guest operatives and they couldn't allow the media to get a glimpse of the iPod leader. So now there are questions as to if really he is Namde Kano. The journalists on the ground said most of them didn't get a glimpse of him. The federal government has released pictures claiming to be that of Namde Kano. But then no one is sure if he is still at the court premises, if he has been taken away. No one is thinking about any of that. We are still at the court premises where Kano is expected to be arraigned in the court. Any moment from now, the federal high court of Abuja, where he is facing trials for alleged reasonable felony. You would recall Khan was granted the earlier and he later as absconded after jumping his day and he's been in the UK where he was arrested yesterday and extradited back to the country today. He is um, currently in Nigeria and expected to appear in court for continuation of his trial live here at the Federal High Court of Abuja.